Hey guys, welcome to day three. Um, those of you that are new to my channel, I am Lindy, aka Paleo Barbie. Uh, I've been keto five years. Hopefully you've watched day one and two before you watch this one. <laughs> um, but if not, go back and watch those. Um, anyways, welcome to the channel if you're new. I'm a hot mess today. I just got back from Houston. Um, we drove in, stopped and ate some food, as you saw, um, breakfast at the hotel. Uh, and we had a great time uh, in Houston. So uh, I'll talk about that at the end of the one that comes before this. But um, but yeah, we're back home now. Um, it's supposed it's about to storm. So I think I'm going to um, wait and see what happens with that before I decide if I'm going to walk today. I may be just doing an in, something indoors like yoga or something like that um, for today. We're also getting the grandkids tonight. So um yeah, and I still need to read my book. I'm going to do that in a few minutes. I was going to do it on the way home, but I was super tired. And when I start reading when I'm tired, I don't know about y'all, but I like start dozing. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so I just wanted to catch you up on the day because I didn't get to say something this morning. There was just so much noise around at the hotel and all that stuff. Um, and he was listening to music in the car and stuff. So I just wanted to check in um, with you guys. And I will show you guys what we have for dinner later. We're probably going to eat leftovers, depending on if we're feeding the grandchildren for feeding the grandchildren i'll probably cook something um but i'll show you all that later gotta go get that reading done and figure out what i'm gonna do from a workout all right for dinner i'm heating up leftover meatloaf that i made the other night with leftover vegetables from lunch so We'll see if I can eat, eat all this. I'm sure I won't be able to, but that is what dinner is to start with anyway. All right, guys, just want to wrap up day three. Um, we got back from uh, Houston, as you saw, um, ended up doing yoga. Uh, it was a great, <clears throat> great time in Houston. We uh, really thoroughly enjoyed the meetup at Hungry Heath's house. And his wife, Shelly, it, it was very nice to see a lot of people. A lot of people that I've see, seen or that are in the keto community that I um, saw at Keto Palooza were there. Um, a lot of them were going on the cruise, which I was kind of having uh, FOMO or whatever you call it. Because <laughs> I really wanted to go with them all because it, it looks like it's going to be a great time. Um, but it was nice to see everybody and eat some good food. Enjoy a little night out at, in a hotel room, get to swim and go in the hot tub and all that. So we really, really had a good time. Um, and then coming home, I was just kind of like, we, we got home about one o'clock back in town and we were both hungry. And so we were like, just, let's just go get something before we go home. So we went to um, a local Mexican restaurant um, and, it, and they had that really cute, cool robot, which it's, it's like a hostess. Uh, robot and it if you have a jalapeno tree in your area i don't know if they all have these um but they it has its own th that there's like a theme song for jalapeno tree that comes on on a uh, tv commercials or whatever this robot sings that and i tried to get i i didn't realize he was coming in time that's why you just saw a little snippet of it um <clears throat> and, and he didn't seat us i was like why didn't he seat us <laughs> i would have loved to have like taken more footage of him but maybe next time anyway i just showed you that snippet of it because it's just super cute um and then for dinner i had leftovers um uh, leftover meatloaf and then i had leftovers the leftover squash squash from lunch that i didn't eat and then i still couldn't eat it <laughs> so um the medication is working in a way that is starting to help with appetite suppression that's why you'll see me not finish things sometimes so i always try to eat my protein first i want to make sure i'm hitting my protein for sure um and if i don't eat all my vegetables i'm not as worried about it um but yeah so let's go over the macros uh macros were 825 calories 150 protein 55 total carbs and 90 fat so pretty good day overall also enjoyed some wine um which is why the carbs are 55 <laughs> uh for the day and the, and um but like i said this challenge uh occasional and weekends uh is when we're, i'm going to enjoy some wine when i leave here it'll probably be thursday night because we have the concerts on the square and then weekends winery stuff and all that kind of stuff so um even though i'll be gone and going out to different places and wineries i'll probably drink less wine there than i do at home because i'm sitting at home i'm you know, i'm more tempted to 
keep pouring, right? If you're out and you're having to pay for it, you don't, you don't drink as much. So it'll be actually be better for me <laughs> to be away from home for this challenge. For, um, so I'm um, looking forward to it. So thanks for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying these um, videos and I will talk to you in the next one.